Praise God. <clears throat> Thank you, Lord. Here we go. He has brought us back into his house of prayer to come together out of the distractions of this world. Don't eat your Bible. <coughs> and welcome everyone here to Repairing the Breach Ministries here uh, this Thursday evening as we come together, come out of this, the distractions of this world to enter in and sit at our Father's feet to come together. <coughs> come together in the name of Jesus. And to receive his word that he has prepared for us this day. And just as always, as we always come together, just remember to keep uh, being continuous prayer for there, for there to be no interruptions, no disturbances, nothing to hinder the receiving of our Father's word by each and every one of us. Uh, those of us that have come together in the name of Jesus on one accord. Being continuous prayer that the uh, broadcast goes off with, without any problems, that everyone has joined together with us online. <coughs> will be able to do so and receive fully just as we just as everybody here has joined as we had joined together in the name of Jesus and uh before we get started let us all bow our heads as we open up in prayer this evening in the name of Jesus <coughs> dear father we thank you and we praise you dear lord for being with us for God and keeping us dear father in the name of Jesus we thank you for the peace that you have given to us and all that you've done for us dear father in the name of Jesus for allowing us to enter in once again, into this your Bible study, and I pray, dear Father, in the name of Jesus, dear Lord, as we come together, uh, forgive us of all the sins we've committed against you. Everything that we've done, fallen short, dear Father, in the name of Jesus, dear Lord. And I pray, dear Father, <coughs> keep us upon that straight, narrow pathway, dear Lord, uh, and, and just to be with us, dear Father, keeping a, uh, being in a, 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 in the midst of this Bible study, dear Father, that our foundation, dear Lord, be the head of it, dear Father, as we all come together in the name of Jesus, dear Lord. And as your word comes forth, dear Father, I pray, dear Lord, <coughs> to remind us all to, uh, to just to come together in one accord uh, in the name of Jesus and, and remind all of all of those that have joined together with us online, dear Father, that that. <coughs> That as they come together along with us in the name of Jesus on one accord, that your blessings, your anointing, all the receiving of your word that 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 is to that, that is to be received, that that will be will be upon them as well. That your arm is not short, that your 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 blessings does not do not miss the mark and, and reminding that that they are a part of this service as well, dear Father. And I pray, dear Lord, in the name of Jesus, as we as we do come together to open up this word unto us, dear Father. That your Holy Spirit will open up into in our hearts, dear Father, as we come before you, as we empty ourselves, dear Father, <coughs> before you. As, uh, as we as we are ready to receive, dear Father, I pray that this word that you have for us, dear Father, will be able to be received, and, and the Holy Spirit will open it up unto us, dear Father, that we will have we will all will have understanding that <coughs> that the, that that uh, that there will be understanding from from the, uh, those that can only handle the handle the milk of your word to those that can handle the meat of your word, dear Father, that there will be none to walk out wanting. <clears throat> or confused or, or misunderstanding that your word will be fully received in the hearts of each and every one of us, dear Father, in the name of Jesus. And Satan, I come against you in the name of Jesus. You will not have anything to do with this Bible study. I command you in the name of Jesus to keep your hands off the electronics, off the broadcast. <clears throat> you will not have any, you will not cut off the signal, you will not interfere with this, with the broadcast of this Bible study that goes on. I command you as well, in the name of Jesus, to take, keep your hands off, off of, off, off of our, all of our fathers hungry as we all come together. In the name of Jesus, you will not, you will not hinder, you will not interfere, you will not, in any way, shape, or form, <clears throat> block the receiving of our Father's word that he has for us this day. And in the name of Jesus, I command you to leave us and to leave us right now in Jesus' name. And dear Father, we thank you and we praise you for allowing us to come in, allowing us to receive your word. And I pray in the name of Jesus, dear Father, as all of us, as we all receive your word, as we all <clears throat> as we all have, as we all gather together in on one accord and in, 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 at your in your uh, sitting at your feet, dear Father, I pray in the name of Jesus to remind us, dear Lord, to give you all the glory and praise, to give you all the accolades. Let our praise and let our praises be lifted up unto you, dear Father, not unto your servant, not unto myself, dear Father, that there may be no temptation of pride to enter in. And I pray, dear Lord, just to remind each and every one of us of that continuously, dear Father. And as well, let it be known this day, dear Lord, <clears throat> to all that are joining together with us. I, <clears throat> I, 
I give myself unto you. I empty myself before you, dear Father, in the name of Jesus, uh, knowing that apart from you I can do nothing. I cannot preach. I cannot teach. I can do nothing apart from you, dear Father. Uh, that, therefore, I give myself unto you in the name of Jesus. Praying that you will speak your word through me, dear Father. Let your word, <clears throat> let the, your word of life flow through your servant, dear Father, in the name of Jesus. And let the word be broken down and received and to be received by each and every one of us. And once again, dear Father, I thank you and praise you for being with us and and allowing us to come to come together and in, in your into your presence to sit at your feet, dear Father. In Jesus' name, we thank you and we praise you, dear Father. And in Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Yay, Jesus. All right, here we go. Back to Revelation uh, uh, chapter 21. Here in 21, uh, we're, we, we've done, what's, what's today? We, we only got through one verse last week. That was verse 11. And uh, the, wor- the, the passages I'm going to be reading, I'm going to re- be reading probably the majority of them out of the, out of the King James, but there'll be some that I do read out of the, that I may read out of the NIV, but I'll indicate it, <clears throat> which is which. And if there's a, if there's a big discrepancy or not discrepancy, if there's a big difference in, in, in wording, uh, I'll, I'll read it out of both of them. So there's no one that is confused or, or misunderstands what, uh, what's going on. But here we go. <coughs> here we go. Uh, Revelations chapter 21 we're going to go over verse uh verse 11 verse 11 first a quick review of what we of what we did uh last week and this is going to be out of the King James version all right chapter 21 verse 11 having the glory of God <clears throat> having, the, having the glory of God in her light and her light was like un- unto a stone most precious even like a jasper stone, clear as crystal. Now, <coughs> as we know, went over last week and the week before in verse ten, the the, uh, the, the holy holy Jerusalem coming down out of heaven, coming uh, coming down from God out of heaven into down here, down to to earth, uh, uh, spiritually to be. Uh, to know it spiritually is to know that that this new Jerusalem is is coming from God Himself, not being set up by man or like an Old Testament, an Old Testament, uh, uh, being set up the tent and, and, and the uh, uh, what is that the the holiest of holies, uh, the holies and, and the holiest of holies, and having the uh, tabern or uh, the the uh, 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 what is that the the Oh, I can't even remember now. It just left me. The, the, the uh, uh, where they had the the commandments in the uh, wo- no, in in the uh, where the cherubims were facing. Oh, Ark of the Covenant. Ark of the Co- That's what it was. That's what it was. Thank you, Lord. Uh, that that <coughs> it wasn't one that was made by man. It, it, this <coughs> like it wasn't an Old Testament, like it, like in the New Testament with the temples <laughs> being built. Even even now, how the church. How churches are, are 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 built by man, and, and it's a sta- It's a, the churches are established by God. The the uh, holiest of holies, the Ark of the Covenant, the temples of the of the, uh, of the Old and New Testament. They were they were uh, <clears throat> they were uh, they, they they were commissioned by God. That God told God it it was uh, for the most part. Uh, the, the the pastors and, and the high priests, the, all of them, they were uh, instructed by God to build those places. But here, <clears throat> this new Jerusalem that came down out of heaven, it w- it it came down out of heaven from God. It it's from God Himself, uh, being if you if you want to uh, picture that as a structure uh, being built, the 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 building was made by God Himself and and given. Uh, to his, to uh, his children, to his church, <clears throat> and now here, what we learn is is having the glory of God in her life, and having the glory of God, the glory of God being uh, this is this is the first this is uh what we're, what the Lord has been talking about the glory the glory of God everything that has the glory of God has that uh that that uh that uh glow if you will. And the delight of God, how we went over last week, we won't read all of the, uh, all of the, <coughs> all of these verses, 
But here in what we went over last week in Revelations chapter 21, verse 2, of the, the, uh, ch the church being adorned, uh, adorned for her husband. And in Revelations chapter chapter 1, verse 6, <coughs> chapter 1, verse 16, uh, as, it, as it says here, um, <coughs> the description of Christ is that uh, it was shining, <coughs> shining as the sun in, in, in his strength uh, as well. Uh, where is it at? And in Matthew chapter seventeen, verse two, where the transfiguration uh, that Christ did upon a mountain, his face, where it says his face <coughs> did shine as the sun. All of these things having the glory of God on them, and as well, and with Moses in Exodus, uh, when he talked with God, and when the second time when he went up to uh, Mount Sinai, uh, not eating or drinking for forty days, and and just uh, and. <coughs> And, and getting and once again uh, God uh, the God, God writing all of these laws and and, instru and, and giving him the, the, the instructions the commandments the laws all of that to him and the, and when he came when Moses came down the glory of God was a, was upon him his face was shiny <laughs> was shining and and, and and he didn't know it uh, that's in Exodus where is that at uh, Exodus chapter 34. Verse twenty-eight and twenty-nine, but all of, but all of that <clears throat> having the glory of God on it, having the glory of God shining down on it, and it says, and it goes on. I'm back at uh, Revelation. I'm in the back on it where it says, and her light was like unto stone, most pre <clears throat> stone, like it's most precious, even a jasper stone. The light of and, and the light. What is when it's talking about the when it, holy Jerusalem? Uh, when it says her light, it wasn't. Uh, the the light of Jerusalem itself. It was the light. It, it was God's glory shining down uh, upon Jerusalem. Uh, the, the the glory of God that was shining off of Jerusalem uh, <coughs> to uh, to that that was seen by John here. And it says here it was it was just as a, as a jasper stone. And that jasper stone over in Revelations chapter chapter four verse three. Was a description that John gave uh, of of the of the throne, and and the throne <coughs> when that, and and God sitting upon the throne. It says that and he was like as Jasper, uh, and this just this just uh, um, further solidifies this New Jerusalem is has come from God, uh, <coughs> and and it has not come from <coughs> anyone else. But God Himself, and now, uh, okay. oh, clearest crystal, uh, the clearest crystal that that the Lord had taught us. La how Lord uh, opened it up into us last week, being clearest crystal. That there's no, uh, there's no defect. There's there's no. Uh, <coughs> uh, what was that? What was that last week? Uh, the diamonds have a, a flaw, or I can't. I can't remember what it was, but but there's there's no there's no uh, f no filth there's no uh, uh, curse of the world uh, upon it there's there's nothing that 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 will soil this place being <coughs> soil this place of the of the curse of the world that because the curse of the world has ended uh, Satan the beast the false prophet all the everyone that followed uh, that that followed him and and did not follow God were thrown into the lake of fire. Not to, <coughs> not to, <coughs> excuse me, not to come come back again. And this is what this is how uh, th this uh, New Jerusalem it it was clear it was clear as uh, clear as crystal. Nothing to interfere with the beauty of it. And now here, this is where we go on. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. This is where we're going on in in, in verse twelve. Or yeah, verse twelve of chapter twenty one. Where we're starting at today. Now here it says, <coughs> and had a, and and had and this is continuing on with with the uh, with New Jerusalem, and it says and had a wall great and high, and and had twelve gates, and at the gates twelve angels, and names writ written thereon, which are <coughs> which are the names of the twelve tribes of the children of Israel. Now, with this city, with this city being great, 
the, along with that, it says here, it says a wall. In the, in the NIV, it, it, it says uh, uh, it, had a, it had a great and high wall, <clears throat> a great and high wall. <coughs> that this wall was not only high, but it was also great. Now, uh, th this is to visually show you that to uh that that there will be no uh there will be no infiltrating of 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 anyone that is not supposed to be there there's not going to be any uh what is that how's that father there's not going to be any invading uh invading uh <coughs> marauders coming over that wall this wall being great being uh oh man oh that's the wrong verse this wall being uh great and high it's like uh where is it at father it, it, it's like here and and flip back to uh Luke chapter 16 <coughs> here <clears throat> which it which uh oh chapter 16 verse 26 i'm sorry and this is speaking of that that great gulf great gulf fixed uh Let's see. Let me let me look at it real quick. Should we read the verse above? Ah, uh, no. We'll read. Here in verse in in chapter in Luke, chapter seventeen, verse um uh, verse twenty six. It says and <coughs> yes. Chapter sixteen. No chapter. Oh yeah, chapter sixteen. What did I say? 17. Oh, chapter sixteen. Uh, <coughs> it says and and beside all this. Between us and you, or <clears throat> between us and you, there is a great gulf fixed, so that they which which would pass from hence <clears throat> to you cannot neither <coughs> can neither cannot neither. Oh wait, cannot neither cannot neither can they pass to us that would that would come from thence. Now, what this is saying here, this is with, with Lazarus, Lazarus, uh, and the rich man, and this great gulf fig that that the rich man w was uh, was tormented in hell, and Lazarus, as it says in in uh, uh, where is it at in, in verse twenty two, where where it says the and it came to pass, and this is out the King James, and it came to pass that the beggar died and was carried by the angels into Abraham's bosom. The rich man died, <clears throat> the rich man also died and was buried. <clears throat> that that uh the, the the rich man in verse twenty three it, it says that that in, in hell he lifted up his eyes, but the rich man being in hell, Lazarus being in heaven, uh, that here between them, uh there there's there's that great gulf fixed there, that nobody that there is no way that one is going one is going to come from the other, uh going to one and to the other. The rich man is is not coming is not going to be going from hell. And, and go up to heaven for for a, a a quick relief or a quick break and Lazarus Lazarus is not going to go from heaven as uh, the 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 rich man was saying to dip his finger in verse twenty four uh, said to dip his finger in water and to cool his tongue <coughs> because of the torment he's being tormented tormented of the flame and the the saying that Lazarus is not going to pass from uh, heaven and go to hell uh for that 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 because of that great gulf fix and that's what this hit, that's what this hit this wall back flip back to uh revelations 21 that's what that's what this wall is talking about that this wall being great and high there is not going to be any uh that that go over it there's not going to be any that uh <coughs> that 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 inf that uh infiltrated no uh in, in this wall uh <coughs> This wall uh, of this city is uh, just how Christ has said uh, uh, when Peter said, you are, the, you are Christ, the son of the living God. And he says, upon this rock, I will build my church and the gates of hell shall not prevail against it. This, this, is, this is continuing on that, that, that all everyone that has walked with that has walked with God through Christ, uh, uh, everyone that, that ha as well in the Old Testament, uh, uh, everyone that, that had been uh, that had been. Uh, of Abraham's seed, uh, they are they're all, <coughs> or that Ab of Abraham's seed that walked with God, that that 
look toward that that followed God and His rules and His uh, and His uh, uh, what is that, Father? Uh, his laws and everything else that are upon are in that city or on the other side uh, or on the other the the good side the <clears throat> good side of that wall. But here, that that's what uh, that's what this this wall is that uh, it, it is uh, a visual another visual of of a great like the great gulf fix that nobody is in, entering into it and here go going on <clears throat> going on here as it says uh and and had 12 gates and <coughs> excuse me had 12 gates and the gates 12 angels <coughs> now here this is where we get into our series of of, of 12 uh, down to verse uh, from here down to verse 17 now 12 just a, as we went over before that 12 is, is the uh, is a is a perfect number a number of uh, uh, the found the foundation governmental foundation uh, government, government perfection uh, uh, foundation uh, how is that father uh, and, and displays God's power and authority and that here at these 12 <coughs> That these twelve, these tw uh, that this place had twelve gates, and now not to, uh, for no one to get to misunderstand anything that thinking that oh there is there's twelve different ways to get into heaven. Uh, flip back to Matthew. <clears throat> Keep in mind that that this is the New Jerusalem that came down out of heaven, and so, <clears throat> and so. <ooh. coughs> So nobody gets confused, and nobody uh goes astray, and, and and when Satan tries to tries to throw you off, saying that there's more than one way to get to heaven. Uh, where's it at, Father? Uh, oh, where was that, at, Father? Oh, here first. Well, here with we'll, we'll this one first. Uh, it says, "Hey, enter, enter ye, in the straight gate." Yes. Oh, I, did I say? Oh, cha uh, Matthew. Did I? Oh, I didn't say Matthew chapter seven, uh, verse thirteen. I thought I did say. <clears throat> Here in Matthew chapter seven, uh, verse thirteen. I'll read this out the <coughs> NIV. It says, uh, "Enter through the narrow gate, for wide is the is the gate, and broad is the way is the." Broad is the road that leads to destruction, and many enter through it. In verse 14, but small is the gate, and narrow is the road that leads to life, and, uh, and only a few, f a few find it. And as well here, flip back to, uh, or flip up to, to John chapter 14, verse 6. And this is what the... Uh, this is this is what is narrow it down to here. I mean, I gotta find it now here in chapter fourteen, verse six, where it says, "And this out the King James, Jesus said, Jesus said unto him, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man <coughs> cometh, unto, <coughs> no man cometh unto the Father, but by me. That is the that that is that 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 straight gate or." Or in the NIV house is the narrow gate. That 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 only through Christ is the way <clears throat> is the way for you to get it for way for anyone to to get enter into heaven, to enter into and to receive uh, <clears throat> the glory of God, for the full glory of God upon them. There, there, there's different. There's twelve different. There's twelve gates here in the New Jerusalem, but that but it's not twelve different ways to get into heaven. This is this is display. This is to display to us that not the number twelve being that perfect number, uh, the number of perfection of God's uh, governmental foundation, uh, displaying His power and authority. <coughs> and <coughs> excuse me. And uh, let's see. And He's twelve. And and twelve. Flip back to I'm back at Revelations. And I hear as it says that in twelve gates, twelve angels. <clears throat> these angels <coughs> that stand in the stand in the way of the gates it, it, it is showing even more even <clears throat> even as well to us the 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 
uh, the guarding of the city, just just to help us visualize the, all of this, the guarding of the city. Uh, just just like in uh, where is that in, in Genesis uh, chapter Genesis chapter three. Let's see, I gotta chapter three, verse twenty four. Whenever uh, uh, Adam and Eve was booted out of the garden. <clears throat> And this is out the King James. It says, so, so he drove so he drove out the man. <clears throat> so he drove out the man and he placed and he placed at the east at the east of the Garden of Eden cherubims and flaming and flaming swords which <clears throat> which turned every way to keep the to keep the way of the tr of the tree of life. Angels guarding against it, so man doesn't get into it. So, 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 uh, uh, Adam and Eve don't get to it and eat, and eat the fruit thereof. Uh, the same way here that these angels, <coughs> these angels, keep. And once again, I'm uh, now keep repeating it uh, that the twelve being the perfect uh, a, no, a number of perfection uh, of divine perfection of God's uh, governmental foundation, uh, showing His power and authority. That these twelve angels, as well guarding guarding these gates, that and, and, and as well keep in mind that that God isn't put that that uh physically, God doesn't need angels at at that uh at those at those uh these gates here at the at the gates because um I can't remember where it is in in, in Revelation it says what well, uh the uh, what is that door closed uh no man can open and 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 the door that opens. Uh, that got yeah you got but you know where it is oh where where is it at let's see if, let's see if you know where it is that no man can can close and and the door that God closed no man can open that <coughs> is it chapter three verse twenty let's see uh no that's a voice knocking. No, that's another. That's that's a that's a Christ saying that what well, he's knocking at the door. But uh, just yell out if somebody. I'm gonna I'm gonna continue on. Just yell out if somebody finds it. But here, <coughs> that these that these twelve angels are are uh, for us to 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 show us for our benefit to set to show us that there's there's guards at each gate. That 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 there's there's no way that for somebody for any anyone for Satan or anyone else uh, to climb over, <coughs> to climb over the wall. Uh, where is it at, Father? Uh, I won't read that one. But there's no one. There's there's no way for for marauders or or, or or robbers to climb over to climb over the wall. There's no way for them to enter to to infiltrate the uh, uh, the gates uh, of the city because there's an, there's angels standing there, and that, and this is for for our benefit. And this is to help us visualize uh, how the how God has uh, how the Father how 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 God has uh, provided security around this whole city to uh, to show us that the the peace that we're going to be under the the tranquility that we're going to be under in His glory. Let's keep in mind that that all of this it, it, this New Jerusalem has God's glory uh, shining down upon it. And now here are these twelve gates and these twelve angels, and here going on even further. I right, don't worry about it if you didn't find it yet. And and, and going on even further, it says the t on the twelve and <coughs> the names written thereon, <coughs> which are which are the names of the twelve tribes of the children of Israel. These names written on each gate. These names written uh, that that are written there are are the <coughs> are Abraham's uh, of of the promise of, of Abraham uh, God promising to, to uh, <coughs> promising Abraham that he that he that he hit that he is that God is himself his uh, 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 shield and an exceeding great and exceeding great reward that here these these 12 these 12 uh, uh, the, 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 the names written upon it upon the wall uh, of the 12 tribes and these twelve tribes are the uh, uh, how's it father the 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 the, the start of it if, if you will uh, 
and the uh, uh, the name the, the the names of, of promise uh, upon that wall that his children uh, not uh, Abraham's children which which are in uh, which are which were the the, the the promise that that God has uh, given uh, to Abraham to have uh, uh, to, to have uh, uh, what was that father the uh, uh, bless the he's gonna bless the whole world through him and and this and this is uh th this was the start of it that that these 12 these 12 um uh children the 12 children that came forth from uh not from directly from Abraham but but came from from uh who oh man who was that uh Jacob that came the 12 children from Jacob in which Jacob is a son Jacob was the son of Abraham <coughs> Abraham and now here he says, uh, the twelve tribes of, of the children of Israel. And now, uh, as well, that it says that the, the children of Israel, but it's not only uh, for the children of Israel. Just that, and, and we're going to go over it in more, uh, a couple times, to, uh, and over in Galatians chapter 3, verse 29. <coughs> <coughs> Here in Galatians chapter 3, in verse 29, uh, I'll read the same way in the uh, NIV. It says, and if, and I'll, I'm going to read this out the King James. It says, and if ye be Christ, then ye are Abraham's seed, and, <coughs> and heirs according to the promise. There's, there's not going. There's no separation in it. There's no. Uh, this, these are the gates for for the Israelites. These are the gates for the Gentiles that that uh, uh that that were grafted in. It's all one. The city is one. It has twelve gates, but the twelve, like I said, the twelve gates are not to separate. Uh, who can go in each gate? These twelve gates are, are that that God's per number of perfection. Uh, his his uh, uh governmental foundation shown his power and authority. But this whole city is is this is one city. Uh, for his, for everyone that walked with God, everyone that that uh, uh, their faith fell upon, uh, w fell upon God, whether in the Old Testament uh, through through the priest and, and, and the uh, the high priest and and, and the laws and, and the sacrifices, or whether it's through the New Testament uh, through <coughs> accepting Christ as your personal Savior, these that that these gates in this city is is made for for every for uh. uh for everyone, or oh, the city's made for everyone, even though the, you see these twelve gates. And now here in verse, uh, <coughs> uh, what verse are we on now? Thirteen. Here in verse thirteen, what time? Oh, we got time. We might get a lot done. <coughs> verse thirteen here it says, and th and on and on the e uh, on the east three gates. On the north, three gates. On the south, three gates. On the west, three gates. That these three gates, three being the divine number of completion and perfection as well. The uh, once again, twelve. Uh, the four times three is twelve, and that's shown as well here. That that his, his per, the, the 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 same thing that that twelve being his uh. uh uh, per, uh, his uh, divine perfect number, uh, divine number of perfection, showing his power, authority, his government, uh, governmental foundation. That these, that these three get that every uh, gate, every uh, uh, the the east, the east, north, south, and west. All of these, all of these have three gates upon them. And like I said, uh, this number three is the number of perfection, the uh, number of completion, number of perfection. Uh, and if you if you want to on on your own it back in numbers chapter two verse one to verse thirty four it it uh reads out the the uh uh the the, the physically the 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 child the the child of 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 uh of of abraham or not abraham, of of jacob and and it and it reads out the name the name and the, the where they are on the gate <coughs> who well, who was on the east who was on the east whose name is on the east gate whose name is on the west 
in the north and the south. And that's in Numbers chapter 2, verse 1 to verse uh, 34. But the more, the, the, more, uh, the, the, the more important part of this is, is the spiritual side, which, is, which, is, is telling it, it, which shows us that, that God's promise is upon each and every gate. God's promise is upon this whole city uh, surrounding it. And now even going on in verse uh, verse 15 <coughs> here in verse here in verse 15 it says and and he oh wait yes oh we skipped verse 14 oh oh yeah man I think we did oh whoops there we go glad glad you found that out you wrote this week. No, I'm just playing. Yeah, this week. And the wall of the and the wall of the city. And the wall of the city had twelve foundations, and in and in them the names of the twelve apostles of the Lamb. Now this is going even further. This is showing the, the verse thirteen was showing the old testament of uh the twelve tribes uh, upon the gates. Uh <clears throat> And the promise of uh, of of where of of uh, where where it uh, not started, but but where God's where God's uh, where God's prom where, where where God's promise originated at. This is uh, of the Old Testament, and now here in verse fourteen, it says here the walls of the city, these walls that reached high, these these walls that in in verse uh, what verse was that? Uh, was it verse eleven? Oh, verse. Was it verse twelve? Oh, okay, where it said the walls, uh, <clears throat> the wall was very was uh, great and high. These walls of this city, the wall of this city, it says had twelve foundations. Once again, twelve being the government governmental foundation, God's perfection, His power and authority. It says in them were the twelve, <clears throat> were the names of the twelve apostles of the Lamb. Uh, twelve apostles of the Lamb, those that walked, those that uh, walked with God, th or walked with Christ, those that that w that were uh, uh, God uh, taught, the ones that that when He was walking with them, when He uh, came back from the cross, rose from the dead, He told them in, in verse twenty-eight to go out into all the world, baptizing in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. That these twelve that he was taught, these twelve he was talking about, is a, uh, <coughs> is a has it, as it says here. Uh, here we'll read it out of uh, Ephesians in, in Ephesians chapter two, ver verse twenty. Oops, I think it went back too far. Uh, here in Ephesians chapter two, verse uh, ver verse twenty. Oops, that's there we go. Uh, it says and <clears throat> and are built upon the foundation of the apostles and the prophets. <clears throat> Jesus Christ Himself being the chief cornerstone. That that's telling that 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 Christ sent them forth. Christ uh, 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 commissioned. Uh, Charge them to 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 do to uh, start all of the, uh, uh, the 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 churches to to uh, to do all of these things that 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 ha that uh, are that have been done. All these churches that that have sprung up all around the world came for uh, of of uh, of the 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 apostles uh, <clears throat> that what well, that that have start that started these churches. Uh, the apostles that 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 have set that started these churches and and, and set uh, pastors, if you will, to to uh, uh, to head these churches. To and, and all of that is from the foundation of Christ Himself, where He said, "Upon this rock I will build my church." <coughs> and now here, uh, where's it at, Father? <coughs> that. As well, well, and and as well that that with with that being said, uh, I gotta flip back to it to say in in a few words that I Ephesians chapter two verse twenty, and that and that being said here where it says Jesus Christ Himself being the chief cornerstone, this is where uh where, where Paul where 
was it yeah Paul uh, is saying in in second Corinthians in in second Corinthians first Corinthians chapter 2 verse 2 Uh, chapter 2 here in first in Corinthians chapter chapter 2 verse 2 where he says for I determined to know nothing or I, I determined not to know anything among among you save Jesus Christ and him crucified this is that this is the part we're here in uh, Ephesians chapter 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 2 verse eight, verse uh, 20 where it says Jesus Christ himself being the chief cornerstone where everything is, is, is built upon everything is, is, is set in order uh, by <coughs> excuse me by Christ himself and now here back in uh, back in Revelations chapter 20 chapter 21 verse 14 these four these are uh, 12 foundations uh, <coughs> it says in them uh, the names of the pot of the apostles of the Lamb. Uh, th these twelve found they, these these twelve uh, <coughs> these twelve it, it found they, it, of them uh, their name as is visually uh, visual aid that that is here uh, of being the twelve names of, of the uh, how's it father of of the twelve apostles is not to 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 lift them up it is just to let you know that that it it was uh, it was. Uh, it was of the through through uh, through God God through them uh, started His church. God through them uh, started his, uh, <coughs> uh, uh, laid that laid that uh, foundation, if you will, of, of the church uh, coming forth and springing forth. Uh, it wasn't it wasn't it it wasn't uh, just to <coughs> this isn't to uh, uh, give homage give uh, homage uh, to uh, the, 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 these 12, uh, whether it's the, the tri 12, 12, uh, twi tribes of Israel <laughs> or the, or these 12, uh, apostles, it, it was to, it was to let you know that it would, that they, that through them walking with God, through them, everything that God, uh, shined his light, shined his glory and started all of this going, uh, his church. And all of us that that walked with him through Christ. And now here, now we'll go to verse. Uh, whoops. Now we'll go to verse uh, fifteen. Now verse fifteen. Let's see. We'll do. Maybe we'll get through a couple more. Maybe we'll do fifteen and maybe sixteen. <coughs> here, verse fifteen. Says and he and he that talked with me had a golden golden reed <coughs> to measure the city and the gates thereof and the wall thereof. Now that, that he said he that talked with me, uh, it's uh in in at verse nine chapter uh, yeah chapter twenty one verse nine that's referring here up to here where it says and there came unto me one of the seven angels which had which had the seven vows full of the seven last plagues and and talked with me saying come hither i will show thee the bride the lamb's wife the lamb's wife that this here and this is the angel that talked with him this is the angel uh is, is that that is it, it, continually showing him this that he that uh that he had a golden reed now this golden reed is showing the the the, pre, the this prestige of the of this city uh, th this holy Jerusalem that that God that God has brought down uh, from from His uh, throne room, if you will, per, uh, um, uh, His throne room Himself, and and, and let and and uh, brought this city forth. That <clears throat> not any ordinary read like uh, in, in in chapter eleven. Where is that? Yeah, in, ch in chapter eleven, uh, verse one, where where the read was given to John, where it says, and there and there was given given me a reed like a reed like a rod and the angel and the angel stood saying rise and measure the temple of God and and the altar and and them that worship therein that that was just a regular reed that 
this this read this read where it said uh the read uh, a golden read is shown how it is uh not it not any ordinary read it will do because this city that uh, that that has come down from God from God himself out of the t out of the tabernacle God himself uh is <coughs> is not any ordinary uh is it, this new Jerusalem is not any ordinary place and therefore it cannot be measured with any ordinary instrument that's why here it sh it's saying uh he he uh he had a golden reed to measure the city and to measure the gates and to measure the wall and here in in verse 16 uh here in, in go ahead down to verse 16 we're here in verse 16 where it says and the city <clears throat> and the city lieth four square and the length is is as large as the breadth and he measured the city with with the reed 12,000 furlongs and <clears throat> the the length and the breadth and the height were of it are equal now all of this being square is showing it is shown even even more so how the the, the perfection of God and 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 uh his uh the 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 perfection of this city there's no walls that are out of alignment there's no uh there's no where where it says uh where is it at father I just lost my place uh there there there's no <clears throat> it says four square there there's no it's not a rectangle it's not a triangle shape it, it it's four square and it says the length that is as large as the breadth and <coughs> and as he and uh and well now here keep I uh, skipped over it forgive me lord that he says and he and he measured the city this city that is being measured is not me how we how we are uh, uh, read in 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 uh revelations 11 one where the angel gave gave the read to uh gave the read to john and and, and told john uh he's where, where and told john to write to uh to to rise up to rise and measure the temple of God or uh in the NIV it says it says who uh he was told to go and measure the temple the temple of God the altar and the worshippers here being being uh not this temple being uh coming out of the the, the presence of God uh coming out or coming out of the tabernacle of God uh this this ain't this sit this city that has that that is being measured with a golden uh how is it with, with this golden reed it is as well uh i i guess it had to be done by the angel by the angel himself it could not be done by john seeing that that john was was not uh did not uh was not in in the uh how is it <clears throat> he still had he was in the spirit but he was not uh, in in heaven. He and, and I guess uh, he it, it had to be done by uh, an angel that that was uh, had the full glory of God upon him. I'm not I'm not sure why it was it had to be the angel, but that's uh, what what it may have been uh, may have been the reason behind it. But now now all of this the city being four square, the length being as wide as the breadth. He says and he measured it with the with the reed. 12,000 furlongs. 12,000 furlongs is 1,500 miles. One city, one city was 1,500 miles. And I, I believe that's like from here to, uh, I think Florida, and 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 that and that was the breadth, the the length and the breadth of the city. So it's all it, it was four square. That's how big the city was. It, where it says here at the end, it says that the length and the breadth and the height of it were equal so the <clears throat> excuse me that it, all, of, all this whole thing this whole city uh w was uh what is it that father it was 15 1500 miles and now as well keep in mind that that this city is the new jerusalem but just as we read in uh where is it at? In, in galatians chapter 3 verse 20 those Chapter three, verse twenty-nine, where it says, "Those who are in Christ uh, are, of, are of Abraham's seed, and according to the to the promise that 
we are as well uh, the 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 Jews as well as the Gentiles uh, are this city belong this city is welcoming in and uh <coughs> and with this city uh where's that father ah uh, here we won't, we won't do that one uh oh wait yeah it said that the length the length and the breadth and the height of it are equal like like uh and we're gonna stop there but like uh <coughs> Oh wait, I forgot. Uh, twelve thousand. Well, I f forgot to say twelve thousand furlongs. Twelve being that number. Twelve being that, that once again that number of God's perfection, uh, per, uh, divine perf the divine perfection, uh, governmental foundation, His power and authority. Once again. And uh, let me see. Maybe we'll do seventeen. Yeah, we'll do seventeen. And now here in, in verse in verse in uh, in verse seventeen. Uh, where it says, and <clears throat> and he measured the wall thereof, and the hu wall thereof, and a hundred and forty-four, a hundred and forty and four cubits, according to the measure of a man, that is of of the angel. Hundred and forty, hundred forty. The wall was two hundred and sixteen uh, feet high. A cubit being uh, eighteen inches from from your from your wrist to your elbow. The ad, well, average size. I mean, yours might be a little shorter. Might only be six inches. <laughs> no, but but this wall this wall here, <clears throat> yeah, it's sixteen inches from your elbow to get a. What? Oh wait, was it? To, is it to the finger? Is it wrist or your your middle finger to your middle finger to your to your elbow, I might. Oh yeah, I might be wrong. Yeah, yeah, I might be. I might have been wrong. It's finger from your middle finger to your elbow. <coughs> but here, the wall being uh, two hundred and sixteen feet high, and uh, and the 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 me as he measured it, and it says that according to the measure of of a man that is of the angel. This is th that's it. That's what this is saying here. According to the measure of a man, the being uh, the cube is being from your uh, from middle finger to your elbow, cubit beans, uh, average of being 16, yes? Well, 144 cubits is 12 squares. Twelve. What's that? 144 cubits yes. is 12 squares. Yes, we're about math math. Math. Yep, cubits. you went to math school. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> yeah, that's what I said from verse from that 12. <laughs> glad you had your, so glad you had your number table with you. <laughs> That not that that's that number twelve once again that uh being being the number of perfection God's authority God's power uh, governmental perfection all of this the 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 city the twelve gates uh twelve angels twelve foundations uh was that uh twelve thousand furlongs a hundred and forty four the uh the wall being a hundred and forty four cubits <coughs> all of that uh it, it, is narrowed down, oh I forgot the the three the uh, three three gates on each on, in each direction being being the number twelve as well. All of that is rounding up rounding up to um, the 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 being uh, the city being perfect, and as well as it sh as it said here that that everything being square. Uh, was that being the uh, the the sit the the square and the length is as long as the breadth as it said in, in verse uh, sixteen, but here that. This this city being the wall of it, uh, being uh, 144 cubits high or 216 feet high. That th this is just showing uh, the 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 uh, not only the enormity uh, visually, but but the magic that but of what God has for uh, all of His children, everyone that walks that 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 has walked with him that will walk with him in at in this time whenever all of this all of this goes down that where God where God had told uh Abraham I'm your uh what is uh, I can not remember what that verse was now uh exceeding great reward what is that ah uh, I can not what is that and I have to turn back to it yeah you showed an exceeding great reward that's what it was uh, that but all of that being 
uh, belo- being <laughs> God giving to each and every one of us, each and everyone here in Revelations, everyone that uh, of the Old Testament, and that's what the the twelve as well the twelve names, the, the twelve tribes of Israel, uh, the twelve apostles, all of that is coming together as one. All of that is being gelled together as one, showing that that he that everyone that has that their faith has fallen upon him their walk has, has been faithful to him that and those here in revelation in the time of revelation uh <clears throat> walking with him not being deterred not being uh not turning away not uh uh being uh what is that uh being steadfast and unmovable and overcoming <coughs> overcoming everything that satan puts in front of him this city God has built, God has lowered down, and God is show, is showing, uh, has shown is showing uh, them that has received that that received this, and even us that th- this city that He has made is being uh, is perfect for each and every one of His children. And as well, where Christ where Christ said, "My Father, in my Father's house are many mansions. If I were not so, I would have told you." This is. This is uh, what visually what what God, what Christ was talking about this this, play, this city being forced and as well uh, reminding that the city being fifteen hundred fifteen hundred uh, miles uh, in, in square. <clears throat> but we'll stop there. Uh, where, do, where do we stop at? Oh, verse. 7. We'll go to verse eighteen. Uh, let's see. Go down the. Start at verse. Let me write it down first. Uh, what's next week? The eighteenth. Uh, this is February 9th? Oh, sixteenth. Seven. I was thinking eight. All right. Uh, sixteen to sixteen seventeen. All right. So read from uh verse eighteen down to verse. Well, let's say down to verse. Eh, just read the whole thing, the rest of it, down to verse 27. Won't hurt you. We'll go ahead and we'll go over that. We will. Uh, we will go over all of that next, or however much that the Lord allows us to get over to uh, study. We'll get. We'll go over that. But it just says always when you when you read, pray, uh, pray, and ask God to open up the Word to you. Uh, <clears throat> However, he may take you through it. Just study and and and, uh, and 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 listen for God to to give you direction and and how he would have and how uh, where he would have you to study from. How he would have you to study and just pray before you read. Just pray as you're reading it and pray and give God glory and praise as as he allows you to be done reading his word. But read down. But read from verse 18. Uh, the, and read just read the rest of the rest of the. Uh, down the rest of the chapter yeah rest of the chapter all right everybody cool Mm -hmm. everybody got it Mm -hmm. any questions or statements anyone want to say anything i just thought it was interesting uh i keep hearing that like nothing in the (coughs) natural world is straight no straight lines um nothing's perfectly square but that's man's doing here so this place is God's doing, and it's perfectly straight and perfectly square. Yeah. So it's completely other than this world. Yeah, this, um, just like the, uh... I don't know why, but it's maybe, an observation. Maybe a curse. Mm-hmm. Alright. Anything else? No. Everybody cool? Yeah. Cool. All right, here we go. I already told you what to study next week. But uh, we'll go on to uh, the invitation of discipleship, anyone that desires to accept Christ as your personal Savior, whether you're here, whether you're joining together with us online, if you desire to accept Christ as your personal Savior, do it because you want to do it, not because somebody else is, uh, is, is, <coughs> is, is pressuring you or nagging you to do it, whether it's a parent, loved one, spouse, sibling, friends, if you... It, do it because it's in your heart to do it. If you're here, so if you're here, you want to accept Christ as your personal Savior, come on forward. We'll welcome you into the family of God. If you're joining together with us online and you desire to accept Christ as your personal Savior, you can do so. You just lift up your voice and invite Christ into your heart. Just say, Jesus, uh, save me. Enter into my heart. Save me. I know I'm a sinner and I know I need to be saved. 
save me. <clears throat> be my leader, be my guide, be my savior. And as you say those words, as you, with all of your heart, your salvation is set. Uh, you have received a full sal your full salvation as you as you uh, open your mouth and, and say those words, Jesus, into my heart and, and save me. I know I'm a sinner and I know I need to be saved. Save me. Be my leader. Be my guide. Be my savior. As you say those words, your salvation is set. Uh, uh, there's no probationary period that you have to go through for your salvation to be complete. There's no classes you have to go through for your salvation to be complete. For salvation purposes, once you say those words with all of your heart, your name is written in the book of life. And your home is in heaven. But uh, that, that's what. But, but your walk of salvation is, is just starting. Uh, your walk of salvation is going to be continuous. Uh, <coughs> that God is going to guide you in this walk. God is going to, uh, it, 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 as long as you look toward, toward him first, he's going to keep you in, in, on that straight and narrow pathway that he has set for you. Uh, and and there will be something. And uh, first, before I get into that, that uh, once you receive Christ, uh, pray first off and, and ask God, pray to God and ask God to take you to a church that is going, that is uh, going to help you in your growth and in your faith in him. Uh, and that don't choose a church on your own, uh, wh whether it's pleasing to your ear or pleasing to your eye or, uh, <clears throat> whatever it may, may be, but, but pray, pray in the name of Jesus and ask God to sit, to take you to a church that's going to help you in your growth and in your faith in him and 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 from this point on as you have accepted christ as your personal savior uh pray when you in your prayer <clears throat> pray in your prayer in the name of jesus and always uh pray in the name of jesus uh but uh but but praying to god and ask him to take you to a church that he has waiting for you and and just as uh as you continue on in this walk of salvation uh and that God is going to take God is going to take things out of your life, take people out of your life, uh, as well bring things and people into your life. Uh, hold dear, hold dear to nothing. Uh, if, if God if if God is is taking it out of your life, uh, allow Him to do so. Don't put it. Don't put anything above God. <clears throat> Whether he's taking some uh, things or people out of your life or bringing things or people into your life, allow <coughs> God to do so. He's going to build you in your faith. He's going to uh, grow you strong spiritually, uh, and, and as he does, as he does so, uh, allow allow him uh, to do it. Pray and and, and, <coughs> and just hold nothing to so close that you're not willing uh, to let God. Uh, either take it away, take it out of your life, if he sees that, if he sees fit for that, uh, as well. Uh, if you, if there's any prayer requests, our email address is beneath this video. It's prayer at rtbministries.us. If you have any prayer requests, send it on in. Once I receive, once I receive it, I'll pray over on your behalf in the name of Jesus. Once again, it's prayer at rtbministries.us. Dot us and uh <clears throat> lastly we'll be uh starting our or, or uh having uh coming back together for sunday service uh, i'll start the broad uh, we'll be starting the the church will be starting the broadcast at at twelve thirty uh and, and we'll start services shortly after that <coughs> and uh if the Lord have you to join together with us online, uh, we welcome you to join together with us online. Like I said, we'll start. We're going to start the broadcast at twelve thirty and start service services shortly after that. And as well, if He would have you to join together with us uh, in person, we uh, uh, gather together at the Holiday Inn Express here in Elizabethtown, off of Route uh, the Elizabethtown Reams exit off of Route Two Eighty Three. Uh, we'll be gathering together a little after 12 o'clock, setting everything up, and, and, and like I said, uh, get starting the broadcast, and, and, and then we'll get everything started. So if the Lord have you to join together with us in person, we welcome you to join together with us, to, to come on down and join together with us in person for praise and worship, uh, uh, lifting up our voices and, and sitting at our Father's feet and to uh, receive His Word. Once again, we meet, we gather together at the Holiday Inn Express here in Elizabethtown. It's uh, off and Elizabethtown Reams exit off of Route 283. Uh, <clears throat> we welcome you to join together with us.
like I said, to, to uh, for praise and worship and to sit at our Father's feet. Uh, and I believe I covered everything. Prayer, church. Yeah, I think I believe I covered. So if there's nothing else, if all hearts and minds are clear, let's all bow our heads. <clears throat> excuse me, and be, to be dismissed out. <laughs> Dear Father, we thank you and we praise you, dear Lord, for being with us, God, and keeping us, dear Father. We thank you for the peace and joy that you've given to us, allowing us to come together out of the distraction of this world to hear your word. We thank you for the bre- for, you, for you breaking down this word for us, that we can receive it into our hearts to fill us spiritually, dear Father, in the name of Jesus. And as we leave out of the, leave out of this uh, out of this sanct- out of this church, dear Father, and go back out into this world, dear Lord. I pray that your 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 presence, your glory, will continue shining down around us. Your angels continue uh, uh, surround, uh, uh, protecting us, dear Father. I pray, dear Lord, to. Uh, Use us as we're out in this world, dear Father, to speak your word to, uh, to those that you would have us to, to be an ambassador out there in this world of, of your word, to be to represent in our actions and our deeds that, uh, of being your children, being your servants, dear Father, in the name of Jesus. I pray as well to be upon the homes and the families, dear Father. Keep us, keep all of us, all of your children together, dear Father. Keep us strong, being all aspects of of the of the family, dear Father. In the name of Jesus, dear Lord, and bless us, dear Father, as well, uh, to to enter into your into your sanctuary on Sunday, dear Father, to come together for your service, dear Lord, and as well for the next the next third next Thursday as we come together for uh, uh for for your for another session in Bible study, dear Father. In the name of Jesus, I pray that for your angels to surround your church, dear Father, that there be nothing to happen to it that we can enter in dear father and, and, uh, and out of the distraction of this world and enter into your presence dear father be with us and guide and keep us O oh lord and all that we do and all that we're going to do dear father in jesus name we thank you and we praise you dear father and in jesus name we pray amen yay, yay jesus